Hi friends. Now I am explaining about this problem. This one of the interesting one and um, little bit logic also there. So here is a question. You have to help a thief to steal as many as gold coins as possible from a gold mine. There he saw in gold boxes and each gold box consists of AI plates. Each plate consist of AJ gold kinds. Each box consists of plates with exactly same number of gold kinds per plate. Your task is to print the maximum gold kinds thief can steal. You need to understand first of all what is the things are. Here is a clear inf uh, information about the question. In this input first line test cases how many test cases are there that will be given the second line NT NT means in this NT how many plates can three thief can steal how many plates how many plates thief can steal the next one second line in denoting the gold boxes how many gold boxes are there and third line number of gold boxes 2 into number of gold boxes and this means AI and AJ first element and second element first element is plates and second element each plate consisting of how many gold kinds this is so in this process we need to choose maximum gold kinds plates by the boxes given boxes so finally we need to get maximum gold kinds for that this is a little bit tricky but i can explain in the easy way First, number of test cases into T. We will take the value of T by using scan. Then, after for every test case, we use while loop. In this file loop, see this cases NT and NT means thief can capable to steal the gold plates. N means gold. Yeah, N means number of boxes. AJ means number of gold kinds. A means number of plates. So we have some clear information about this. And there is here three NT. Thief can capable to steal the number of plates are NT. Take the value of NT. Then after number of boxes or N. Take the value by scan using scan. So we need to use one array to take all elements, number of plates and the, their respective kinds. Here is the array. is double of given boxes take the every value of the, in this every value by using for loop of 
after this what we need to find we need to find which is the maximum number of gold cans having plates are there this is the first plate in three boxes are there this three boxes first plate consisting of three gold cans and second box is consisting of two plates and each plate consisting of two gold cans in the third box consisting of three plates and each plate consisting of one gold can this is the information which is given by input so how to solve this we need to choose which is the best one in this one we need to find out the maximum one maximum gold cans which plates have so we need to find out the position of it for that i am choosing the variable p and then for number of gold cans finally for the gold cans this initially it is zero for value how many plates can keep uh, thief can st steal is empty i need to i need to find out the this one then what i want to taste i need i would like to find the maximum gold cans having position by using this method i'm sending the complete array with the number of elements number of elements consisting of what here is the method max position give the proper method i give the value for 2n 2 into n n and the array here is the address of array and what i need to find is position and i need the one more value max maximum position so here is a for loop i equal to the goal cans places are 1 3 5 so i need to start with 1 and up to oh, where up to n and every time i add the i plus 2 for moving one goal cans to another goal cans so first of all if max more than a of i then max equal to a of i and i need the position also position is the most important one so i take the position in this way i am finding out the maximum gold cans position i return it and finally i get this one after this there is a two chances are there one is nt minus a of p minus 1 and chance more than 0 like nt means 3 3 minus maximum value is 3 also how many plates are there one plate is there so 3 minus 1 is 2 so what happen when it is i take the gold cans P minus one number of plates into number of gold cans. After that, I make the value of 
p equal to 0 then nt minus equal to a of p minus 1 I remember the which, how many plates I took. Then after, for suppose the maximum value is more than three units, then how how we how we will take the gold coins? Gold coin equal to NT complete the plates what three units into gold kinds nt will become zero and this way here is complete then after what we get is gc gold kinds maximum gold kinds this is the process then once we need to check it, check it out. Seven and twenty. Seven is the right one. We need to test for submit. Successfully, it is completed. Thank you for watching. For more videos. Please subscribe. Thank you.